So, how to refine the data of our student、uh, or the report, historical report from previous years、um, in their diagnostic or test? So, first thing we do is、um, connect to iReady and make sure you have your credentials in. And then you go to reports. And if you see you have class, student, and badge, if you go to badge you could, and class, you could only see the report from this year. You don't want to see the report that,、uh, from last year unless you are, have the admin account. So you could see their scores way back. So you go to student and you go to historical. All right. So historical resorts, because you want to see what their scores from last year or previous years. So instead of end of the year view, you took, you're going to take、um, a standard view. And then you pick a student who you want to see, like the performance wise. So let's see, I'll pick one of the students that I know that she has to report. So now you see this student has grade three, grade four, and grade five results. So if you look at For grade three, you could see the scores that you got, which,、um, which one of the domain she is not good at. So you could see and you could see the pattern. So actually, she has a red flag doing that because she's in, she took it、um, second grade instead. And when she was in fourth grade,、uh, she didn't take the first one, but she took the second and third one. She's in early fourth and mid fourth, so it looks like she was able to、uh, make up. All right, so it went up, so that's nice. So, fifth grade, she's early five, early five, and mid five, which is a very good score compared to what she got. But then you could see that she needs、uh, help on、uh, algebraic thinking, but she's in fourth grade. But if you look at the end,、um, she was able to make it up. So, And then、um, that's for fifth grade. And that's how you're going to find a、um, report for your students. And you could go back to your、uh, students again and pick the next student.、Um, let's pick another one. So let's say, let's pick a seventh grade. I don't know what seventh grade I had, I forgot the name. s i l l y it. Jurassic? I think Jurassic is one of my seventh grade students. So, got sixth grade. Oh, look at this. You get a sixth grade report. And、um, in sixth grade, it took only the diagnostic one, and he's a fifth grade level. But then, if you look at it,、uh, the placement will be number of operations, but you will get trouble in geometry and measurement. So, you could use that data to connect to that person、uh, for this,、um, for this uh, grade level. And if you have questions, we could、um, go again. I hope that helps. All right, bye.